Hey everybody, welcome back. Thanks for joining me today. So being so close to Halloween, I thought we would do a quick sort of Halloween inspired swipe experiment. So here I'm just laying down a black base. As usual, all of my paints are only mixed with just distilled water. And today I am using a mix of golden acrylics and Amsterdam acrylics. Just torching some air bubbles there and now I'm just going to spread the paint out a little bit to make my base make sure you like comment and subscribe okay now here we go I've got this sped up a little bit for you guys I'm just gonna lay down some of my colors I've just got some nice bright red orange and yellow don't need a lot of paint here just want to get enough color to move around now if you're ever finding when you use yellow on top of black that your yellow and black mix together and make that weird gross disgusting baby puke green uh, look what is in your black if there is blue in it to make your black then the yellow and the blue obviously and the black are going to mix and make that disgusting green so try using a different black um, or one other way you can counteract that is by adding a ton of white to your yellows that will usually help so there i've just taken some white paint over top and done some swipes in some of the areas i've done some black swipes now, as you can see here, cells pop up immediately in the black area and they're not popping up in the white. Now, what this tells me right away by watching it was that my white was not the same consistency as the rest of my paints. The white was a little bit too thin, so it's not going down through the other paints and then coming back up to create the cells. It's just sitting on top in this thin layer and it's not interacting with everybody else like the same way the black is. So I'm not getting the same kind of cells. So if you're finding in your paintings and you're trying to create cells with just paint and water and you're getting that thin looking layer of something on top that should have given you cells, that's your issue. You're just, your consistencies are off in your paints. So make sure you work on that to make sure that everything is exactly consistent. So here I'm just spreading the paint around. You can see the awesome cells forming there in that black swipe area. So when I do this again next time, um, I don't know why I have such an issue personally with white and being able to get the consistency to match. I've been doing this for years and I still have that issue. Um, but I seem to be able to nail the black for consistency. So I will just go with that next time and just do black on black with some nice bright colors underneath and try it that way. But that's okay. I like to learn these lessons and be able to share that with you guys. So if you're having it all the same problems, then maybe I can kind of help explain for you some of what's going on. As always, if you have any questions too, if something's happening in your paintings, shoot me a comment or an email. I'd be more than pleased to uh, give you my thoughts and tell you what I think's going on. I've done so many experiments over the years that, you know, I've got a pretty good idea of what's happening. <laughs> so here I'm just touching up my corners and edges, making sure that they've all got paint on them. Don't want to see that white canvas popping out. Gonna give it another torch here, see if I can get any more of that white to sink down and those colors to pop up. Sometimes it does take a few minutes as well. As you'll see in the dried result does look quite a bit different than the wet result. Just want to adjust my composition here slightly. Make sure, make sure, make sure you scrape your drips, especially with a painting like this. So here it is wet. Oh, I love those cells. Some of them are starting to come out in the white now. It's been a couple of minutes. 
Still not as many as I would like. The black side has way, way more. But overall, for an experiment, I am certainly pleased. I think it turned out really cool. Love to hear what you think. Oh, I love this section. Look at those cells. They're awesome. Okay, so here it is all dry now. I'm very pleased with the final result. I like how it turned out. Lots more cells popped up for sure in these areas as it was drying. Still love that area. But I am very pleased. Let me know what you guys think. Have a great day, everybody. See you soon.